Okay, y'all, so I wanted to talk about real quick what I got. Like I said the other day at Riff Raff and at Mama Loof, and I don't have all the things that I got for my pup set, Lucky Dog Barkery, but I was just going to talk about it real quick um, at the end. And then, depending on how long I ramble on, I might talk about, um, I guess, these would be like fashion favorites for March, and then I will also have like beauty favorites. So we'll see if I cannot make this last too long. Um, We'll get to that also, or I'll make it into another video. So anyway, the first thing um, I got was this really awesome blue bag, or purse, I suppose, um, at Riff Raff um, for over 75% off. Okay, y'all, you'll probably be cracking up when you look at this video because I do have only one hand-painted nail polish. I even went to work with this today because when I do many pictures on my Instagram, I usually only do one hand, so... I'm starting a new thing. Only paint one hand, y'all. Anyway, um, you can see how they ha this has like these faux studs on the top of the bag, and then it has like several layers. So I was really excited about that because you have like um a few compartments to go into. Let me see. I'm gonna move forward. There's like arrows in there. Um, and this middle part isn't really like a compartment, but you could easily just like throw your phone in there, and it would still not fall through the middle um and it also has like a strap that goes around it so it's kind of like a crossbody. it's quite uh quite small actually um i like larger purses i like to carry a lot of things on me at once um but i love how this has like the gold accent with the dark blue um and in person this is really almost on the verge of like a purple so although it does look a little different so is my shirt does not doesn't look the same on camera as it is in person but almost um, and then it has like this back compartment too, but I have the strap off of it because I would be using, sorry, I have to get this out of the way, I would use this bag as, um, just like a, just like a clutch basically, I would carry it under my arm or something, um, with like a dress or something, I'm not really sure, I haven't tried wearing it yet, um, I have tried putting my Kindle in it, which fits perfectly, it's really awesome because this was less than $20, I think it was like $16 or $17 um, at 75% off, so I was really happy because there are quite a few things in Riff Raff that are fairly expensive, um, I saw something as high as like 400 and something dollars, but then they had items that were like all the way down to just a few dollars for like um, really cute greeting cards and other things. Um, I would certainly use, I'm going to put this up here. Um, Riff Raff is a place for a holiday shopping guide, which is something that I am going to talk about a little bit more on my blog. Um, I would like to make a holiday shopping guide for everyone so that if you're in like the Dallas area or if you're shopping online and some of these stores do have shopping availability online, I just wanted to make something from my own experience, places that I thought were unique, that you can find something that is, you know, just different, something you wouldn't find <clears throat> probably in you know, a regular fashion magazine gift guide or something, so keep an eye out for that, I'm not really sure when that will be released, but once I finish it, it will be brought up several times this year, just as different holiday and birthday ideas and whatever, so anyway, there I went again, but there were quite a few things at Riff Raff that I would definitely be purchasing, or will be purchasing for presents, so, um, one of the other things I got, um, was this little lace bralette at Riff Raff, which is like so cute. I just think it's awesome because I don't have a lot of just like nice, um, what do you call it? I guess it's like a bralette type where you don't, it doesn't have like wires or any plastics or anything in it. I mean, obviously you could wear it under like tank tops and other things for in the summertime. I just think it's so cute and comfortable looking and they have quite a few there. This one I obviously had to get because it was mint, but then they also um, had many other colors and these were I think about $12, which isn't a bad price, but they did put it in this cute little bag and it came like wrapped up in polka dot tissue paper, so I mean they do um, have like gift wrapping and stuff also at Riff Raff, so if you do have to get a last minute birthday present or what have you, they'll wrap it right there in the store. Um, I think that's really awesome because um, <clears throat> I definitely like to have things wrapped when I leave and you just feel nice walking around with wrapped goods. Um, <clears throat> so anyway, excuse me, keep this out. Um, the other boutique that I went to is Mal Maloof and they're just up the road from, um, 
riffraff, so just a nice little walk on the corner. And there are a whole bunch of other stores there, too, um, that I didn't get to, like Kendra Scott and other ones. Um, sh I think Aftershock is the other one that I really want to go into and look around. But I um, ended up getting this really cute score um, at a $15 rack. This is a $15 necklace. Um, well, on sale. I'm sure it was a lot more um, full priced. But I went through a few of their necklaces and I was like, nah, they're okay. And then as soon as I held this one up, I was like avoiding holding it up to myself because I knew as soon as I saw it, I was going to be like, oh, I have to have it. So I did put a picture up on my Instagram the other day of me wearing it with like a black sweater. But I would also wear it with like a black dress or other things. Um, you can do a lot with it. And it's really cute spring color. So those, that is a blue color. And then I also got the purse that's blue and then my wallet um to my phone which is in front of me because i'm recording on it that's like a mint color so i'm just i'm really into all the blues right now and i'm wearing blue here i'm just i'm obsessed with blue and then the other thing that i got <laughs> this month were these glasses <laughs> aren't these so cute i just ah oh, they're so awesome i put them on my instagram also a couple of times and i saw some other fashionista i not remember remembering where she was from, fashion blogger who was wearing these with like a really big poof type skirt and these and I just thought they were so cute. It was like a winter picture. She was wearing like fuzzy gloves or something. I don't remember. But it just looks so cute and I looked these up and these were only ten dollars at zerouv.com so I was really excited about that you have to go see what other glasses they have because they have so many different styles and they came in a really nice little zero uv bag so i love anything that comes with a bag and it makes me want to put things back in its bag so <laughs> i was happy with ten dollar purchase that came with this nice little set and i just thought it was a really good deal and they're uv sunglasses so you can tell when you're driving around that they're protecting your eyes better than other things so this is another one of my favorites. I will be wearing these as long as possible until I lose them, break them, whatever. That's why I always like inexpensive sunglasses because I always end up doing something to them. And even though this has a case, it's not a plastic case. So I might have to purchase a plastic case so that I can make these last as long as possible. But if they don't last, I can just go buy another pair because they were $10. So I thought that was a really awesome steal. And... Um, I'm looking at probably uh, eight minutes or so, almost eight minutes in this video, so I think I will break it up and do a beauty favorites video next, um, before the month is over so I can take a few more minutes to look through my stuff because I was just kind of like, this, 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 and if I have time, I'll talk about it, but I mean really the stuff that I carry in my makeup bag is stuff that I use all the time and I have some new ones that I've added to it this month for my Ipsy purchase and other things, so yeah, we'll talk about that next. Just don't want to make this video too long. Um, if you haven't yet, please um, thumbs up this video and subscribe so you get to see all my other videos I'm going to be working on in the future. And I appreciate all of you guys watching, um, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye!